What's up guys, welcome back to Nervous Tales. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you guys can get yourself the permanent portal fruit for free in Blocks Fruit. So yeah, let's get started. So yeah guys, the first thing you guys gotta do is basically come over to the middle town right over here, as you guys can see. Now, once you're here, basically set your home point because we're gonna be coming back to middle town a lot in this glitch. So yeah, basically just set your home point just like that. Now, once you have done that, all you guys gotta do is just go ahead and go over to the blocks fruit dealer in the back of this mansion talk to this guy all you guys gotta do is just go over to the uh, like the portal fruit in this uh, shop like this click on gift on it click on store in inventory and click on gift wait until the uh, thing comes saying insufficient funds or if you guys already have the money to buy this uh, the purchase screen or you guys can do just click on cancel on those and basically reset yourself without closing this menu okay so yeah now once you have done that i guess i do just click on exit on this click on this black box go ahead and go over to any of the starter islands so i'm just gonna go ahead and go over to uh the marine start area so yeah just get yourself to any of the starter islands and i am here now once you're in one of the starter islands i guess i do is just take a quest guys so basically any starter quest would do now I guess what I do is just simply complete that quest. So I'm just gonna complete it super fast, just like this. That should probably do it. Yep. Now after I've completed the quest, all you guys gotta do is just go ahead and go over to the blocks food dealer of the start area that you went to and do the same thing that I showed you guys. So gift, cancel, and now basically reset. Wait until you respawn now. After respawn, click on exit and click on this black box just like that. Now, once you have done that, all you guys can do is just go talk to the uh, weapons dealer in here. So, I forgot the dude's name. Um, uh, give me a sec, guys. All you guys can do is just go ahead and go to this dude right over here. That dude right over there. All you guys can do is just talk to this dude. Like this. Go ahead and go over to slingshot and get yourself a slingshot even if you have the slingshot you guys gotta do this guys okay so yeah now once you have done that go ahead and go over to items and go get your slingshot just like that click on equip on that now go ahead and go to any place that there is an npc and basically all you guys gotta do just use your slingshot to kill like one npc okay all you guys gotta do just get a little bit of xp okay so yeah Okay, this is gonna take forever. Uh, let me just. Okay, never mind. That's gonna take forever now. Um, I have nothing else that is. Okay, I, I just gotta do this right like this. Um, come on. Just a little bit more. Come on. Just uh, a little bit more and just like that and I'm almost done over here and just like that I have gotten myself some XP so yeah you don't technically need to get like the mastery love all you guys can do is just get yourself a little bit of XP and you'll be good to go and if you guys have the slingshot at max you don't even need to do this part guys okay so uh, yeah now, after I've done that, all you guys gotta do is just go ahead and go over to the middle town once again. Now, once you're in middle town, all you guys gotta do is just go over to the captain. So, you guys know who I'm talking about, this dude right over here. I guess I do just click on this guy. Uh, do not go over to second C, guys. All you guys gotta do is just click on, just talk to him just like that. And click on never mind, just like that. As you guys can see so yeah if you guys are in the first c you guys can still do this part because you're not going to the second c so yeah you guys got you just interact with this dude and you'll be good to go now yeah now go ahead and go over to the blocks with dealer right over here click on this guy click on continue after that view robux wait until this thing pops up and click on cancel and if you guys don't have the view option right over here and you guys have the portal fruit uh like equipped it all you guys gotta do just uh, do the same thing that i told you guys earlier basically a store inventory thing and that should work too guys okay so yeah 
Now, after I've done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to a boss quest. So, yeah, just do any boss quest and you'll be good to go. I say good to go a lot. So, yeah, now, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go to the... Where did I get... What? Okay. I suddenly got stuck on something. Okay. So, yeah, now, all you guys can do is go talk to the adventurer, get yourself a boss quest. I mean, not this dude. Just get yourself any boss quest and you'll be good to go, guys. Okay, so, yeah. I'm just gonna obliterate this boss right away. Just like that. Now, after I've killed the boss, what you guys can do is just go talk to this dude. You don't technically need to get yourself a fruit, guys. So, you guys can do is just uh, get to this point right over here and click on never mind and quickly reset yourself. Just like that. You don't need to do this part if you guys actually get yourself a fruit too, guys. Okay, so yeah. Now, uh, once you have done that, what you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the Marine Star area again. So yeah, this one's specifically Marine Star area, not like the Pirate Star area. So yeah, just go ahead and go to the Marine Star area. I'm just gonna get myself right over here, just like this. Now, once you're over here, what you guys can do is just talk to this dude right over here. Click on slope and get yourself a marine slope. Now, after you've got yourself a marine slope like this, I guess I do just sit on it, drive it a little, just like this. Now, once you get the C title right over here, I guess I do you just reset yourself. Now, wait a little bit. And once you respawn, do not move, guys, okay? If you guys move, you would have to do the whole glitch all over again. So, basically, do not move. Now, I guess I do just go ahead and go on the shop, more fruits, and click on view on the portal fruit. Or gift uh, if you guys have the portal fruit as equipable. So, yeah, I guess I do just click on the Robux. Cancel, cancel, exit, and click on X on that. Now, I guess I do just click on stats. Go ahead and go over to this, uh, like, uh, bar where you put the, uh, like, the stat amount you want, and basically put the max amount that you guys have so max amount that you guys have not the max amount of the game uh, the, literally the max uh, like uh, stat you have uh, just uh, put that number in here okay so yeah now after you've done that i guess i do is just click on x on this go ahead and go out to shop more fruits once again uh now click on gift not view gift cancel cancel X on this, go ahead and go over to the, uh, like the Pirate Star area, Bandit Quest Giver right over here. And just get yourself a quest and simply confirm it like we did in the first part. So let me just end this super quick. Never mind. Alright, let me just end this like this. And the quest is completed. Now, once you have done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the jungle area again. Just get yourself over to the jungle area. Is that a 2.4 bounty? Yeah, that's the 2.4 bounty, dude. <coughs> Alright. Like, that's not the 2.4 bounty, dude. Is it? Deny craft. Yeah, that's not the craft. So yeah, now you guys can do just go ahead and go over to the adventure right over here. And basically do uh, like uh, two quests in here. So literally anything except for the boss quest, guys. Okay, so. Oh wait, I'm killing the wrong people. I thought I got the, uh, like, the monkey's quest at first. Alright. Let me just end this super quick again. Okay, did not mean that to happen. And now once you have done that, all you guys gotta do is just get yourself the next quest and complete that one. So the monkey's one for me. And yeah, just simply complete it.
And yeah, the quest is complete. Now I guess what I do is just go ahead and go over to the middle town once again. And now once you're in middle town, I guess what I do is just go to the back of this mansion and you should see the blocks with dealer. I guess what I do is just talk to this guy, click on continue, open up your shop, store and inventory, click on gift. Wait until you get this screen, now click on cancel. Now you have done the glitch guys. So to get the portal of fruit now, what you guys can do is just wait until the, like the blocks of dealer shop resets. Now once it resets, it should just appear in the items tab. So it would just appear like this. As you guys can see, I have a permanent shop like a thingy over here. It, it would just appear like this. And uh, you, all you gotta, gotta do is basically click on redeem and you should get yourself the portal for it for free. So yeah guys, that is basically it from me today. I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.